Oh, you aborted them. You must be an expert at math. We need to find a cure for this terrible disease. No one has aborted them. You are giving me good eye contact. Yes, you must be high functioning. No, 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 no. I need to know what end of the spectrum you are. Are you level one autism? Are you level two autism? Or are you level three autism? Which one are you, you autistic person? <laughs> You know, I'm, I'm fed up of non-autistic people leading disabled conversations online. And I'm not the only one. There are millions of other autistic people that feel the exact same. Hi, I'm Kian Bintry. We are Access All Areas, and this is Access Not Denied. Today, we are going to be discussing the hashtag actually autistic. Now this hashtag began trending in an outcry in the autistic community about how neurotypicals were talking over people with autism and speaking for autistic people. And me and millions of other autistic people are, to be blunt, sick the f***ing death of it. This hashtag helps us take control over our own narrative. When you see the hashtag actually autistic, it means real authentic stories coming from real autistic people from our own point of view. And this is why this hashtag is one of the most popular neurodivergent hashtags across all of social media. I started using the hashtag actually autistic because I noticed that there were a lot of non-autistic people basically dominating the space. And I think that there is a lot of value in hearing from non-autistic voices, but it's also a lot of value in listening to lived experience from autistic community. For so long, autistic people haven't been heard on autism. It has been discussed largely from a non-autistic point of view. So the hashtag actually autistic to me is symbolic of autistic people having the power to describe the inner autistic experience rather than it just being about describing what autism looks like from the outside. It was also symbolic to me of the incredible communities that we have in online spaces and the power and support behind those. I think autistic voices are important online because there's people that have either just been diagnosed autistic or autistic people that have been diagnosed for a long time but they don't feel like they see themselves in the media and then they can come online, find other autistic people and find a community and that is something that is very very important because there's a place where people can you know speak about their special interests and connect with other autistic people and not feel so lonely like a lot of us do sometimes. I wanted to tell my story, share my experiences, my research, my community work and the hashtag actually autistic felt like a space where I could do that and where you know my autistic lived experience would be recognised and heard. Now this hashtag provides us with opportunities to watch ourselves speaking authentically online, which gives us confidence to do it ourselves when we see other people, other autistic people doing this. Who are your favourite content creators or influencers? Please let me know in the comments down below.